Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you three different ways that you can hook live minnows, whether you're fishing for crappie or whatever fish you want to catch. Stay tuned. Just get outside and do something awesome. All right, guys, so I'm out here today and I'm actually trying out kind of like a new spider rig technique for me on the kayak. And uh, today it really seems like what they want is that live minnow. So I'm gonna show you guys three different ways that you can hook a live minnow to get the most action out of it and I be most effective with it. So let me grab some minnows here. So the first way that I'm gonna show you is, this is the way that I learned whenever I was a kid. Um, it's just really simple was to just go up through both the lips so if you look at the minnow you're just going to start at the bottom and you're going to go up through both the lips like that now the one thing with this is it does force the minnow's mouth to be closed you're going to hook up through the bottom of the lip and up through the top lip and because my GoPro is not cooperating, I'm going to take a picture here. Really simple, huh? So I'm going to get this one back out. And then once we catch a fish on this one, I'll show you a couple more ways once I catch a few fish. I think I might have one here. Yep, I definitely do. I was sitting there talking to the camera about how to hook a minnow. And I've got one on. Well, that one actually came on the jig. Huh. So I'm gonna throw that back out there. So I had one of my minnows come off here. So I'm gonna show you the second way that I like to hook a minnow. So the second way I like to hook a minnow, let me try not to hook myself here. I've got this minnow here, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the hook and I'm gonna go inside the mouth and out the side. Now, what I find is this seems to really help um, with keeping the bait more lively, but the problem is, is that sometimes what that causes, it's a lot easier for the fish to get it off of there. So then I have the issue of constantly having to replace minnows. So if I'm running out of minnows or the fish are really finicky, um, it gives it more action, but it does make it easier for the fish to get the, the minnow off there. The third and final way that I'm gonna show you how I rig up a minnow is you can take the top of the hook and skin it across the back of the minnow and when you do this I like to go from the back to the front and it makes it really hard for those fish to get that off there so I want to take a picture again show you guys exactly what I'm talking about hey guys so I hope you enjoyed those three different ways to rig a minnow when you're out fishing and hopefully that helps you out if you're trying to figure out how to rig live bait whether you're crappie fishing or fishing for whatever so as always guys i appreciate y'all watching uh, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my content and as always guys get outside do something awesome get a chance to take somebody with you i'll see you guys in the next video hey guys if you're enjoying these tips on how to rig minnows please hit that subscribe button below so you don't miss any of my content